Hi everybody, it's Frostelf VA and welcome to my very first Let's Play series. And this series is going to be focusing on token Rombu. I have been waiting literal years for this game to be released in English. It is a game from Japan where you embody this character known as the Saniwa. And your job is to basically defeat the uh, these monsters that are looking to destroy many different parts of history of Japan. And what better way to help you on your journey than actual historic Japanese swords that have been personified that you can collect, train, level up, all sorts of cool stuff. It, it got adapted into so many anime series, the live action movie, um, stage plays. It's very, very popular. And I actually, I actually collect some of the figures. I own um, one of the DVDs of the anime. So... I'm really, I'm really obsessed with this series and I'm so happy that it's finally here. So let's get right to it. So let's start playing. I'm so excited. The year is 2205. Revisionists seek, seeking to change history have begun to attack. To prevent such threats, the government of the time has sent Saniwa to each age. Saniwa, with the power to arouse the object's hearts and emotions, could bestow powers powers to fight and wield, I guess, thus created as the, Suku, <laughs> the Sukumogami. I'm so bad. I'm sorry, my Japanese is really rusty. Okay, and we're back. I'm sorry if that was a huge jump and you guys wanted to see the opening animation segment, but I'm not going to... I'm sorry, um, but I'm not going to show that because I don't want to get copyrighted because Token Rambu is under strict copyright. I uh, like the music in it, so... Um, Token Rambu. I'll, all right! Let's get started. I am really excited. Um, so I already kind of know how this game is going to start me off. We're going to get to choose um, one sword amongst five different starting swords and I kind of already know who I'm gonna pick um so let's let's go okay so we're gonna enter our name and I'm actually gonna use my actual name because I highly doubt frost elf would fit in that box so uh Okay, these are all the swords that we can choose from to start with, and uh, this is who I'm picking. Okay, that's fine. So this is who I'm this is who I'm gonna start out with. It's Hachiska. This is my favorite character in Token Rambu. Um, I love this guy so much. So this is who we're starting with. Yes. I know a lot of people are probably gonna come at me though. Hi! Greetings, my name is uh Konosuke. Oh, it's nice to meet you. What do I do? Oh, there we go. I will be working as your guide, and I am glad to make your acquaintance. Excuse my haste, but we have received a report that the enemy has made their move. Oh, they're already gonna throw me right into battle? Let us... Let us sortie... Let us sortie from the menu and begin a plan to subdue, subdue them. Um, I don't know if that's a translation error, but... Okay. Oh! Oh, it's called Sortie. From here you can go out on the battleground. Select the Sortie button and proceed to the battlefield select screen. Okay, so I click this. That's nice that they're gonna start us out on how to play. This is the screen where you select a battlefield. By proceeding through a battlefield and defeating the enemy leader, a new one becomes available. Now let's select our first battlefield and Sortie. So select the team. We only got one sword. This is kind of sad. Okay, that was a cute animation. I really like that. 
you have successfully sorted uh this is gonna sound so weird to say here we have the battleground screen the battleground is divided into location which you will proceed through automatically depending on the location you will have battles with an enemy team or you can or you can obtain resources now let's begin our move forward so i just oh it moved it moved me automatically i thought um you had to click on the little dots okay enemy already detected we have engaged with the enemy what you have done is recon and doing so reveals the enemy formation that helps you decide on which formation is most beneficial for you choose your formation and begin the battle um oh we have to choose this one in battles attacks attacks will come in order of who has the widest range of mobility. If no team has been defeated, the side that has inflicted the most amount of damage will be the winner. Okay. Oh. Oh, okay. You can now use um, Shingen. Um, Hisasu. To be able to activate it during your first battle is quite impressive. Once activated, your power will greatly increase until the end of the battle. It's likely that the move will be activated when you receive damage. If one token uses this, others can also continue the attack. Cool! Um. Did I mess up? Yeah. Well, that was sad. Hmm. Unfortunately, we have been defeated. Losing a battle will force you to retreat. Let us return to the home to the Homaru and heal the injured token Donchi. Call him Hachiska, please. He has a name. Well, that's embarrassing. Heal the injured token da Donchi by repair. Let's try repairing your token Donchi right away. So, menu repair. I guess this whole entire video will mostly be a tutorial. I'm so sorry, guys. Let's have a look at the repair screen. To perform repairs, it takes both time and resources. Two token can be repaired at once, but you can expand this to a maximum of four later on. Make sure that not too many token Donshi get injured at once, or there won't be room to repair them up to repair them all. Okay, so select and repair. Okay, resources have been used to start the repair. Normally, we have to wait for the remaining time to be used up, but if we use help token, the repair can be completed without having to wait. That's nice. Help token, please. It's one, one token <laughs> fixed up and ready to go. You're going to need a stronger team to have success on the battlefield. Let's go to the forge and create a new token. Oh, nice! Who are we going to get? I'm going to say this right now. I kind of already know some of the main token Rambu characters, but not some of the ones that they've come out with recently. So um, I'm excited to see who we get. Resources and request token will be used during the forge and token Donshi will be made after some time ha has passed. Depending on the resources used, the token Donshi can be made will differ. So try experimenting with various combinations. Also, the number of token Donshi that could be forged at once are two and would be up to a maximum of four. Be careful when making multiple token Donshi as rooms for forging are limited. Okay, so um, here's where you can select resources you'd like to use. You can click or drag on the number of resources or on the up and down arrows to determine the amount to use. For now, let's go with what we have. Oh, okay, so we're gonna start with 50 each. I like this little animation, this is so cute! Looks like you have begun forging. Normally we'd have to wait for the remaining time to be used used up but I like that but wait if we use help token the forging can be complete he's gonna make me use all my help token um help tokens I have prepared a help token for you to use oh thank you yes who'd I get who'd I get oh <gasps> oh 
出された博多の藤四郎で担当はてあそこですか Oh, it's one of the Tontos! If I remember correctly from the, from the anime, this is the one that、um, is very big with finances and stocks and stuff. Okay, so now we're gonna make some troops. I'm sorry I didn't read that one out loud. I'm trying to like, get through the whole tutorial so we can actually play. So, okay, the troop screen. It does. Okay. Okay, so we're gonna use 50 each for this one. Oh, nice! Looks like your troops have been completed. Wow, that was quick. When it comes to making troops, everything is done instantly as there is no wasting time. Waiting time. Next, let's assign the token Danshi and troops you have made into a team. Oh, okay, so we're gonna go back to the formation screen. And build a team. Okay, here we have the formation screen. First, let's take token Danshi you, you have just made to place them into a team. Okay, and then we'll select ha,、um, Hakata. Okay. And now we're gonna put some troops. Okay, so they're like items. Put this guy in there. Now, complete the placement of your team. I have explained all there, all there is to it. Now, let's go over the game. How, over how the game is played. Yes, please. Create token da Danchi by forge. Yep. Create troops by troops. Assign teams by formation. The sortie and, sortie and defeat enemies. Heal the injured Tonko da Danchi by repair. And that will be all. If you don't understand how to maneuver or play the game, you can always check how to play located at the bottom of the screen.、Um, I'm not sure if this will get cut off in the recording, but there is like right below the play screen, which is up here. There are these little tabs where it says、um, news. Event dash campaign, how to play, frequently asked questions, and then the official Twitter,、uh, Twitter link,、um, which I have opened up here because I didn't know if、um, like, the game was down for maintenance when I first started recording because I just had like, a black screen.、Um, but I know there is an event currently going on because of the Twitter. So、um, if you ever start playing, pay close attention to these down here. Important updates will also be added there, so make sure to check frequently. Yes, I know the game is going to go under maintenance, I think, tonight. So, if you ever feel lost at what to do next, check on mission from the menu. Information regarding battles, formations, and so on can be located here. For now, let's aim towards completing your missions. Yay! Oh, nice! Once they are completed, you will be rewarded with resources or other useful items. That's exciting! That's nice to know though that like, you go on these missions and、um, you still get stuff out of it. Okay, yeah, this is one of the events that's currently going on right now where you can get、um, uh, Kuma, Kuma, Kumamoto.、Um, so, and then this is another one I think that's going on.、Um, achieve two goals and obtain these two guys. I don't know who they are, so they definitely were、um, recently. Added to the game. I do recognize that voice that voice actor right there, though.、Um... Oh, another one. They got a lot. Oh, wow. They got a lot going on. And of course, like a lot of games, you could just click this button to not show this again if you don't, if you guys don't want to see it. Oh my gosh, there's a lot of stuff going on. I'll have to come back later. Oh, and there's an unlimited time forge going on. I'll have, to, I'll have to come check this out later. Oh? Reception. What's, go what's going on? Hi. What? 
Um, what's going on? Well, that was weird, everybody. Let's see if I can jump into the forge here. Hmm. Should we forge something, guys? Like, we got the resources. Let's try. So we'll forge. Okay, and we got... 30 minutes. So, menu. Okay, so this takes us back here. Okay, oh, and we got messages. Oh, yeah! I forgot. When you pre-register for the game, you got, like, all sorts of free stuff. So let me just uh, accept all of these real quick. Inbox is empty now. And let's actually go back to the forge real quick, because since we gained a whole bunch of new, more help tokens, we're now at uh, 40, let's use one to see who we got. Who'd we get? Oh, it's another Tonto! <laughs> All right, we got a Tonto Hirano. Okay. Let's go to the sortie. Oh, wait. We got a mission. Hold up, let me look at this real quick. Oh, uh, forge a total of three times. So, what happens if we. Oh, cool! You complete missions, you get stuff. I'm already liking this, because the more missions you complete, the more stuff you get to help in your to help in your mission. Okay. Backdrop. We can change the backdrop? Sorry guys, I'm like wanting to check out everything. This is really cool. Oh, cool! I can read oh, I'm already in love with this. Oh my god. Yes. Okay, let's go look at the formation real quick. Change which can be overwritten at any time. Okay. Tapping the apply button will let you apply the saved formation to the current team. When you overwrite a formation, the confirm screen will appear. The confirm screen will show the saved team on the left and the current team on the right. Make sure to double check before you confirm to overwrite. If the saved team includes unavailable token banshees such as those on, on a survey, they might not be applied. Okay, any token who cannot be applied will be dimmed and will not be included. Let's go ahead and apply this. Team 1 has been... Oh my goodness. Team 1 has been applied to save Team 1. Note that all members except for the dim token Donchi have been applied. Members can... Oh my goodness. Members can also be excluded for the reasons other than being on survey for details. See how to play. Okay, I can't really do this then right now. Um, okay. Forge, troops, repair, refine, duties. Let's go here. So this is still kind of dimmed. I can't do this. I can battle against other players. You guys may be seeing me battle my friend who's also going to be playing this game with me. <laughs> okay. Let's go. Select a team. Hmm. Let's go. Let's see how I do this time, guys. Hopefully it's a little better than last time. You 
I'm already really enjoying this game, guys. Like, we may not have made it very far yet, but um, it's it's definitely it's definitely everything that I've heard about about this game. Oh yay! We did it. Oh, we did it, you guys. Nice, we got an A. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure in order to get. Oh, we leveled up Hachiska too. Nice. All right. Should we? Um. Let's continue because Hachiska is still kind of okay. So I'm pretty sure if I'll pull him back if he hits yellow, like I'll pull back. But for now, I think we're okay. Oh, there's been an enemy detected. Scouting failed. Oh no. We're gonna have to... Um, we're just gonna have to go, since it's unknown, we're just gonna go with the first one, and hopefully this works. Um, it seems like we're doing good. Oh, oh, yeah, nope, he, he's in the yellow. He's in the yellow. Oh no. Oh, we still made it. We still made it, y'all. Oh my goodness. I I seriously thought we weren't gonna make it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay, and now we're back here. We have completed two missions. Head into battle. We did that. We got a request token, charcoal, steel. Nice. Yep. Okay, what else do we want to do? Oh, there's a record. What does this look like? Okay, this is basically my battle my battle record. Um, enter a message. You can edit messages shown to other players, so let's type in. I am so happy to be to be here. Oh, we ran out. I am Let's just leave it at I am so happy. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Let's go to the forge. I say let's forge. Let's forge one more. Let's forge one more token. Oh, uh, let's forge one more sword. And we're actually going to do a hundred charcoal, a hundred steel, and then leave the rest at 50. Let's see what we get. Okay, this one was set to 20 minutes, so that's not too bad. It's just enough for us to go on another sortie real quick. Okay. Um, can I do the event? Okay, we've received a special investigation request from the government. We may enter the abandoned realm until May 17th at 11 p.m. This mission requires you to remain in the area for an extended duration, so your aid will be unable to sortie. Therefore, you will need to sortie with a team other than Team 1. During special investigations, you can order teams to wait in the battlefield while you return to the Homaru. Please note that you cannot assign, refine, or repair any token Danshi that are, on, that are deployed. Okay, so we can't really do that. We can't really do that event. Oh, that sucks, but that's okay. I'm still... I get it like I'm still a beginner. <clears throat> oh, I forgot! I forgot, Hachiska... Hajiska's in the yellow. Let's uh, let's repair him real quick. And we'll go ahead and use a help a uh, a help token for him so we can get him back on the battlefield real quickly. Let's go.
Okay, so we need to roll a dice, a die to get here. Okay. All right, we were able to figure it out. So we have an advantage in this formation. Let's do it. Ooh. Well, that didn't last very long. <laughs> we are doing so well. Like, we're doing so well, you guys. Oh, nice. So we leveled up Hachiska to level three and Hakata to level two. Oh, we found a new token, Donchi? What? You can find those? Oh, it's another Tonto! Oh, we got a Kita! Oh! I didn't know you can find them on the battlefield. That's really cool! Darn it, we went back here again. Oh, and we found... We found what formation they're taking? Great job, boys. We did it. <laughs> How we doing, everyone? Oh, we found another one? Wow, I should probably call this um, Token Rambu, episode one. We find lots of swords. Oh, what, what's your name? Yagen! Yes! Oh my gosh, I didn't think we'd get him this episode. I'm happy. I am 100% happy, you guys. We actually got him. That's amazing. Let me get all of my, um, uh, all of my stuff. Leave a message for battle records. Oh, wow. Oh, token library. Is this where we can see, like, all the swords that are available in the game? Because I know there's been quite a lot. Oh! No, every time... Okay, every time you collect one, they're added to the, to the roster. Okay. Huh. That's really cool. Can I see, like, oh no, I can't see who the, like, hidden ones are. Let's go check on the forge, see how we're doing. You know what? Because I'm, I'm gonna get close to probably ending this episode soon. Let's just go ahead and use one. Oh, I keep hitting no, because I'm so used to yes being on, like, you know, that side. So, let's see who we got. <gasps> My favorite Tonto! So this is Goko, uh, Goko Tai. This is my favorite Tonto in Token Rambu. He has tigers for pets, which I think is really, really cool. Okay. Let's add Gokutai. Yagen. And Akita. You know what? We're just gonna go ahead and put all of them in here. <laughs> so we can only it seems we can only have a team team up to four. Let's refine. 
The refine is where you can strengthen your token donchi. Select the token donchi you want to enhance. Select a token donchi as refining partner. Different abilities will be enhanced depending on the token donchi selected. Choose with care. This panel shows the token donchi's predicted abilities after refinement. All that's left is to select begin refining. Note that refining partners will not be returned. Hmm. Okay, so this is like if you have copies, I guess. So we don't have any of that. So let's go to duties. In the duty screen, you will have to make one team of two token donchi to perform 24 hour duties. You might have thought, what 24 hours, but not to worry. Even during duties, duties, your actions are not limited. You can still sortie survey and bout during duties. Well, think of it as day duty for students at schools. Now onto the explanation. Oh my gosh, I love this little fox. Click the select button for each duty. Select token donchi to perform the duties. Both token donchi do not have to be in the same team to be paired. You can even select token donchi who are on survey or being repaired. To begin, select start duties. Lastly, you do not have to select all team to begin, so there is no need for you to make every, every pair if you don't want to. Utilize it according to your needs. Hmm. So this bumps up that. This bumps up that, and this bumps up that. Okay. I feel like we need more attack power, so we're going to do Hachiska, and let's go with... Hmm. And Yagen. And start duties. Oh, you eating as you can was to go to me. Cold and actor. It's now possible to raise token Donchi's Rambu level through fusion. What? To perform a fusion, first switch from the refined screen to the fusion screen. Select the token Donchi whose Rambu level you want to upgrade. Select a token Donchi to be the fusion partner with, with the add button. Only the same token Donchi will be displayed make a selection. The right panel shows the predicted Rambu level after fusion with the currently selected token Donchi. For every extra token donchi, a fusion value of 100 is added. Okay, so if you have multitudes, they all have different, I guess, abilities and levels. All that's left to do is select Begin Fusion. Note that fusion partners will not return. And I don't think we have any replicas. I can do what now? Great news, you can now obtain seasonal produce. Seasonal produce can be exchanged for special backdrops and- Oh, okay! So, seasonal produce can also be obtained from sortie, survey, and duties. Let's start with duties, which I'm already doing. On the duty screen, you can obtain compost from horsekeeping, produce from fieldwork, and white con conpeto from sparring. Okay, we kind of already went through this. Okay. Oh, there are requirements. At the exchange, you can trade four types of seasonal produce for white competo. I hope that's how you say that. Oh, 
Oh my gosh, there's so much to know about seasonal produce. How's our status doing? Team one's on standby. Let's collect our stuff. And I say let's do one more battle. How about you guys? We do one more battle. Oh, we can do a survey now. Let the teams depart for survey missions. Do we want to do survey or do we want to do sortie? Hmm. Let's do sortie. We'll do survey in the next episode. I feel like Hachiska will be okay, so... Uh, oh, we can now do team two. Alright. Let's charge into the battle, everyone. Let's go, guys. Oh, wow, that was quick. <laughs> that was a that was a quick battle. Okay, so don't sustain any damage and you get a great S. Okay, let's continue, guys. <gasps> Are we finally going to the left? Finally! We're finally gonna get out of here, guys. And not see the same map over and over and over again. Okay. Wedge. Awesome. Where's the... Here we go, advantage? Let's do this, guys. Okay, so there's only two of them, thank god. Oh, no. Oh, no, not Gokutai! We still made it, y'all. We still made it. We got an A. That's totally fine. I am totally okay with that. Oh, cool. Who all leveled up? Hichiska leveled up to level four. And then the rest of our Tontos. We are already starting this Let's Play. That is like, what guys? Like the fourth one? Who is it? It's another Tonto! <laughs> I remember this little guy. This is um this is Aizen. I Aizen. Aizen. Aizen Kunitoshi. He's also a Tonto. But I just find Tontos everywhere. Oh cool, we got new areas unlocked. A new battlefield has been unlocked. Nice. Okay, guys, and that is probably where I'm going to end this first part of Token Rambu Let's Play. If you guys like my Token Rambu videos, um, give it a like, probably subscribe. I will continue to upload videos as they come out, so hopefully when, um, when we record episode 2, our, um, the duties will be finished. And I, I guess like what I'll do is I'll play a little bit off screen, see if I can figure a couple of other things out so when we come back like um the game will probably be a little more a little more fleshed out this felt like more of a tutorial video on how to play since i haven't played token rambu so until today so thank you guys so much and i will see you all in the next token rambu video have a great day and i hope you guys are staying safe out there and i'll see y'all later